Hello, this is Jane Talbot and I am just swerving by to update you about my next big adventure. Two weeks today I will be in England for the West Midlands Masters Track and Field Championships which will be taking place on the Sunday of that weekend and that's my kind of trial run at the 400 and 800 meters. I won't be tapering for that event. My purpose in going there is just to have an experience of racing at those distances and to get a feel for an athletics meet. It'll be the very first time I've ever competed at those distances. So I've been training for this since the beginning of January. I don't think I've missed a run training session in all that time. I am feeling good. The only thing I haven't managed to do so far is run in my spikes. I need a track for that. And I haven't learned how to get out of the blocks. Now those are two serious issues that need tackling before I go to Nuneaton for those championships. So next week, I'm having a bit of a special adventure on Tuesday. On Tuesday is a big day because Tuesday's the day when I will be learning with my coach Richard Lappin how to set up my blocks and get out of them. This is crucial for the 400 metres. Could be the undoing of me. Then, also on Tuesday, I'm going over to Antrim in the evening to train with the Ballymena and Antrim Athletics Club. And I contacted them because they train at the track in Antrim. And I asked if it's okay for me to go to the track and try out my spikes. The challenge for me is running in spikes, running round corners in spikes, and staying in my lane when I need to stay in my lane. There are other things I need to learn. I need to learn, for example, when to break lane in the 800 metres. I think that's quite a tactical race, and I think that's also going to potentially be the undoing of me. But basically, having a go in my spikes is something that's going to be really important. And I think it's absolutely brilliant that they've invited me to go along to a Tuesday session and a Thursday session if I need to. And I'll be training with a group of middle distance athletes. Now, when they said that, I thought, oh, this, like, I've got it even now, this horrifying feeling came into my body. And it took me right back to the very first time I stood on an athletics track. So I have stood on an athletics track. I've not actually run on an athletics track. And I was a member of Coventry Cadiva Harriers. And we used to meet at the athletics track. And it was like a bit of a James Bond film. Whenever you went, there was always someone famous there. I remember the first time I went, Marlon Devonish is a famous 200 and 400 metre runner. He was actually on the track. And everyone was standing there saying, that's Marlon Devonish. I found the whole thing a little bit overwhelming. I was in my 20s at the time and I went out training for the first time. It was a six mile run and I went out with a group of runners and I was right, right at the back and I think they left me right behind. And I was humiliated or felt humiliated because I was overtaken by some Coventry Cadaver walkers. They were walking really quickly. The really positive thing about joining that club is I did meet runners at my level and we went out for social runs so that that was really lovely I haven't been a club runner for a long long time and so I feel a little bit anxious about um next Tuesday but I do feel really positive about the fact that I am being welcome to go along to that track and have a go and who knows what's going to happen and I will definitely keep you posted